Trio Tools is a comprehensive iOS device management tool that provides all-in-one solution for managing, backing up, and restoring iPhone, iPad, and iPod Touch data. It offers features such as jailbreak tools, a ringtone maker, flash and restore, a file manager, and much more. With its cleverly optimized user-friendly interface, Trio Tools makes it easy for users to manage their iOS devices, which softwares such as iTunes fails to provide. Hey, what's up guys? This is the greatest intellect here. Welcome back to another ad, uh, I mean video. So today we're going to learn what is Trio Tools, how can we download it, set it up and use it with any of our iOS devices. As I've already given you a brief initial introduction to the software, let's jump straight into the downloading and setup process. So to get the software in the first place, we're going to search for it on Google as we always do and we're going to download it from their official website which is 3u.com. Next up, install and launch the software and you will be created with this kind of interface upon launch. Now to do anything with the software, we need an iOS device connected using a USB cable. May it be an iPhone, iPad or one of those obsolete iPods which are useless by today's standards but so once you connect any of the set devices, the software will then ask you to trust the computer. Then check your connected iOS device for a pop-up notification, asking you whether it should trust the device or not. Click on trust and put in the passcode if asked. After that, the software will start scanning the device and will provide you with a test result of the device information. There you go. As you can see here, it is giving us general information about the device, like the name of the device, the storage capacity, color, battery capacity, iOS version, whether it's jailbroken or not, the production date, and so on. I think the most important ones of all of these metrics are the two on the bottom. The one on the top is the estimated charging cycles of the device. In other words, the number of times the device has charged and discharged in its entire lifetime. So one charge and one discharge means one cycle. And this battery has around 1598 cycles, which explains other metric, the battery life, which is actually not the charging percentage, but the battery health, which is sitting at around 81%. This is something you can check in the device settings, but some devices like the iPads don't let you see the metric. And this is where 3 Tools comes in. Now, if we click on details, you can see again the charging cycle times and the actual capacity of the battery, the design capacity. Now, if you look closely, you will notice that the actual capacity and the design capacity have a huge gap between them. This explains the age of the battery and can be a really important metric to make the buying decision if you are buying a pre-owned device or if you are confused, should you choose to replace the battery of your current device or not. This can be the prime decision maker for you and I totally believe that this is something you cannot find in iTunes or anywhere else, which makes 3 Tools a must-have piece of software. Now, there are still tons of features to explore like the Toolbox section, the Smart Flash section, and the Ringtone section as well, which I believe is a lifesaver. As you know, setting up a custom ringtone on iOS devices is like an experience on its own. I'll be covering all of these topics and more in the following episodes. So make sure you subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon to be notified as soon as I upload these videos. Till then, stay safe. Catch you in the next one. Bye.